Okay, this is what I was thinking of doing, <laughs> but I forgot to do earlier. I'm gonna do it now. Oh no, that's exactly what I did earlier. <laughs> I could not do it. Come on. I don't. Oh, know. you just killed Jason. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I yeah, did. Right. Hey, what he does is he moves me out of the way so I can then do it properly. Oh. Ow. I am the winner. <laughs> Anyway, game on. So it's time to be I'm serious. Stop messing on. around, guys. It's fine. I'm not messing about. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Samantha Janice is here and everything. Game on. Is that what that is? Hmm. Right. Yeah. Do you not remember Samantha uh, Janice? I do. Yeah, only the first season was good, though. Oh, I agree. The then second they got season. the second um, main He guy. was fine. Yeah, they got the other guy. He was fine. Who wasn't um, that good an actor. I didn't like <laughs> And missed the whole point the whole point was that the, the, the guy was ridiculously handsome but just absolutely mentally fucked. And the was second that the guy whole point? wasn't that good looking. I'm not sure it was. Yeah, it's a large part of his character. No, but you can be up yourself without being handsome. You can just think you're up. Ben Chapman. Being handsome. Yeah, but Ben Chapman was ridiculously handsome. That's I why know, he got the role. Still is. All right. That's why he then went to America I think you just to be in a criminally underrated uh, romantic comedy called The Truth About Cats and Dogs. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah so me too. I believe oh, that's where I first Who did saw that have in it? Uh, Uma Thurman. Really? Who I grew to love. Yeah, it was, that was the early 90s or mid 90s, maybe. Yeah, but she'd been doing films since she was like a teenager. Yeah, I don't tend to fancy teenagers. Yeah, da dangerous liaison. I. <laughs> I didn't. You've never mentioned fancying before. I knew you would have been a teenager. Well, Uma, everyone knows what? 90s Uma Thurman is the most beautiful woman in the world. I've, I'm sure that's come up on this before. I no. love Uma Thurman. She's a stunning woman. I have never found her attractive in any age range or bracket. <laughs> so it's I, the same with Cameron Diaz. I, I hear people say that. Do wow. not find her attractive. Cameron Diaz is she too is not thin, like but she has an amazing smile. No. I'm... I, I personally, she just doesn't do anything for me. I think I'm learning that I'm not that picky. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to yeah, finally yeah. start doing a job. Or whatever I'm doing a job. Like You're invited to. to the job. You're enjoying the I'm job. I'm coming. Talking... I've, I've accepted the You're invite. Talking about how internationally renowned... You know, top ranking FX and sexist women are actor. not quite your type. Uh, well, you weren't listening to me. I was saying she was very much my type. Well, yes, she is, but you didn't like. You don't again. like Heather Graham. I do not like Heather Graham. That? But that is not through any fault of her own. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, please, she's good. I'm pleased she didn't go out to not be attracted to. I know, you. I got it. Sat there and gone. Do you know what? I hated Austin Powers 2 so much, I wouldn't even shag her if she was on fire, which doesn't make sense. It doesn't really. It's, kind it's of never advisable. You might catch something, like, on fire. That reminds me, right? I was uh, <laughs> talking to one of my is this gonna go? colleagues at work. Yeah. Sorry. And he, he said that um, he was cooking in, like, well, this is a couple of years ago. He, he was cooking and managed to set himself on fire. <laughs> so I asked him the question, you know, did any of your friends piss on you to put you out? He said, no. It's like, well, then all your friends <laughs> would piss on you to save your life. And he was quite upset by that. Okay. Well, I don't know if he was upset by the not being pissed on or... Did, did any of his friends do anything? Or the fact anything? that he's got no friends. Did, did they attempt to help? Um, I don't know. Did, did they stand in a row and piss uh, away I... from him? <laughs> like the ultimate <laughs> fuck you. Right, I apologise. It's teams again. Damn it, why do you tell him? Okay. Oh my god! Yeah, but... Neil, this is a bit swirly. I don't know what's going what's on. What's this about? It should... Oh, you've oh, got to get in the safe zone. Yeah, get in the safe zone. Oh, wait, is it... Both of you versus me? No, no not at all. Oh, you lot are the worst. No, you're the worst. Get out of that zone. Get out of it. No, you get out of the zone. I'm way in the zone. 
The Zone of the Enders. That's a bloody awful film with Molly Ring, Ring World. Ring what? What was it? Molly Ring World. Where's the thing? Where's the thing? It's over there. It's over there. Zone of the Enders. I'm trying to think of that one. Is that a? There's got to be a fantasy or something, right? It doesn't quite sound like sci-fi yeah. to me. So I'm thinking of. Uh, I know it's sci-fi. It is sci-fi. That's what I thought you were getting at. Yeah. That wouldn't have had EastEnders Molly yeah. Ringworld in. Unless she was old. I'm just trying to connect oh, to TV a, shows now. There was an East EastEnders Enders person in uh, Doctor Who, and I still to this. I keep forgetting to look him up, and I can't remember who he is. Do New Doctor Who. Doc yeah, yeah, the one that was on Sunday. Uh, I don't watch what it. What character I, I, does he play? I, I can't stand it. So the one really. who was in EastEnders. Goodbye, somebody. Yep, I don't I watch EastEnders. Cocked that right up. It, the guy who oh, famously. There, then. Uh, the, uh, the granddad, then. The not granddad, granddad. He's quite famously oh. been in EastEnders a lot. Is he even in that? He's not in EastEnders, is he? Oh. Pretty Bradley Walsh. Why Bradley I Walsh, served him once in a shop. Was. Yeah, he came in my shop years ago. I was quite Did he say but... anything about being in EastEnders? He didn't. I'm not convinced he is in EastEnders, is he? I mean, I'm basing this on the fact I've not seen EastEnders for about 15 years. Yeah, that is true. I I might be confusing him. I tell you what, I might actually be confusing him with someone else. He seems more of a Coronation Street kind of guy to me. He's Yeah, he's in or, Coronation or... Street. Or doctors. I, I knew it was a bloody soap. Or sons and daughters. Bloody soap. <laughs> oh, I don't bloody soap. Need to see someone. Um, yeah. East Enders game. Oh, him, yeah. What about him? I forgot what this conversation was. He was I, in Doctor Who. Oh, you were going to look him up? Yeah, I was just trying to everyone gives a shit, John. He used to be in that year, the British version. It's new of this week. Doctor Who is just shit. Doctor Who is awesome. And it's sometimes shit. So yeah, it's 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 very like, degrees Doctor of quality. Doctor Who from like the eighties when it was like um, Colin Baker boy? and uh, yeah, all them. They were good. This well, thing is just a complete. Oh, what? Just... I think you're, you're looking yeah, for now that they have I think, right? production values, good actors, and a solid script. It's bad. But that old nonsense with plastic. You are bullshit. you are talking to people, John, here that do actually actually watch Doctor Who as a hobby. <laughs> I've seen a couple of episodes, and I can't say that I was particularly impressed. We've by seen it. all of them. No, we haven't oh, yet. We we've still got. No, we haven't. Still got we like have still in most the of Tom Baker to go, and that's taken us four years to get to. Michael keeps saying, "Don't worry, there's only one more serial," and then there's like a billion more keeps lying to us. Right, I'm not going to just <laughs> drive into but that my this time. My summary of Doctor Who throughout time from 1966 to 66? 63? 1963? November 12th, 1963 through to... Uh, oh, shit. Don't get ya! Oh, damn it. Oh, yeah! Uh, yeah. The general gist of Doctor Who is it's mainly a good idea, and sometimes it is exceptionally good, and okay, and sometimes it's just a bit bland, and sometimes it could have worked, but it didn't quite. That's my opinion. But I always enjoy it, except when I don't, because it's a bit shit. Wow. Put that in your DVD cover. <laughs> Once again, Jason taking a mighty stand by sitting on the fence right in the middle. I take a mighty stand on the fence. <laughs> Well, it is. That's the point. It's a show where it can be anything, and that's good or bad, and it just depends well, on that, what's going on. Is it Baywatch? It can be any act. <laughs> it can be anything. It's like, that's not a standpoint can, at well, that all. Well, that turned into... Bay, well, Do Baywatch. you not remember that three-year period that David Hasselhoff was Doctor Who? <laughs> he wasn't far. He was. He was up for it for a while. They kept talking about him, didn't they? I think we should start an online petition <laughs> to have David Hasselhoff well, in Doctor did. Who well, as Paul the McGann, Doctor. Everyone was saying it should be David Hasselhoff. Well, not what? Like David, the Daily Mail. That's that it. Paul McGann film was. His name. That was shit, his, day, his name was definitely banded around as Doctor Who. David Hasselhoff. Wow, that would have been amazing and also. Awesome. 
As long as there was a red float in there somewhere. <laughs> and he gets to sing a new theme anyway, song. My point was, it can be <laughs> anything. <laughs> because it can be set in any time or place with any actors. Generally, the genre can change week by week. So it can, it's basically just like a drama show with happens to have a, it's an anthology series really, it just happens to have a, a linking character idea. So it can be crap, it can be crap. Yeah. I've got an opinion this week, I don't usually. <laughs> oh my god! I'm going to name the episode, Jason forms an opinion. <laughs> well no, you, you didn't form an opinion because... <laughs> You, you started by saying sometimes it's good and sometimes no, it's shit. It's, st it's still completely wishy-washy and in the middle. So, I think the opinion is sometimes things are in shades of grey. I just want to point that out. Not everything is black or white. You can't say this is... What? You can't say 53 or how many years it's been now of TV is always good. 50 shades isn't. of grey. Is that a shade of grey? 50 shades of grey is... Well, no, I did see that film, the first one, and it was a bit shit really, really? wasn't it? I haven't read the book. But I understand that's also equally shit. But people seem to like it. Isn't that book a Twilight um, fanfic? I believe yeah, it started as well, fanfic. It did, and you can definitely see it. I <laughs> just, just said that. So I. <laughs> what I heard is there's a bunch of Twilight fanfic, and uh, it turned into tw um, Fifty Shades of Twiglets. Nice show. Yeah, I was watching the, the uh, Fifty Shades of Grey film, and it's it's weird in the sense. I mean, not the sexy bits. Well, not really sexy bits, but not the sexual bits. But uh, like the other stuff is like a teen movie. It's really it goes. It, it, that's another thing that jumps between the genres. It seems to be like a little. Actually, I might be thinking of a different film. <laughs> you see, Christian <laughs> Grey was a time traveling alien. I don't think I am. I think it's it. It's sort of halfway through, and if anyone's seen this film, Jason, have you got the bit where they're in a diner halfway through, and she's like a small town girl living in a lonely world, living in a lonely world. Yeah, um, it's that bit which reminds me of like um, some sort of. Oh, Bye. Go forward, you name. motherfucker! Who played this big car? That's a line from the film. <laughs> <laughs> It's one of those sort of teenage films from the late early 90s. It reminds me of that. And then it goes a bit, oh, should we get a bit kinky? And then it kind of goes a bit, I don't know. It's just a bit of a letdown. One of those anyway. I've, I've never read any of the books or seen any of the films. So I can't me remember. either. I've but also they just not my cup of tea. Twilight or Red Twilight like on which it is based. I have seen Twilight. Seen I was forced to watch it by one of my friends. I know which friend. Um, <laughs> funnily enough, the friend that... In oh, no. Was it Dan? Uh, you introduced her to me, so... Um, that is the friend I'm thinking of, then. Yeah. yeah, and funnily enough, that friend makes her husband um, sleep in a twilight bed sweat. <laughs> oh, we're all choosing the same one. Thank so you. he's got to sleep there with Edward or um, on the pillow. Jacob, wow. I was thinking this the other day. I could not could he not at least the names have of the, the two main characters. <laughs> could he not at least have the pillow with the girl on? Or is the bedspread just the blokes? Oh, I don't know whether there is one or not. I, I didn't pay that much attention. But if that was in my house, that would mysteriously disappear. Yeah, it would. Like, it... they've moved houses a couple of times, and it's like, <laughs> oh, where did that go? I, I wonder why it's in yeah. your house. <laughs> to be fair, you live on your own. <laughs> Unless it's your guest bedroom. What? What if someone put that duvet in your house? Uh, I'd burn it. Oh, what, if it was, what if I gave it as a Christmas gift? Oh, I would still burn it. Okay, three teams. Funny enough, I did actually have to... Sorry? I've done it. It's three teams. We should be okay. Um, I did have to buy the Twilight box set for somebody and ship it to Japan for them. I know. Wow. That's be as well. uh, that is the only interaction I've ever had with Twilight. Is this it's person okay. just a massive it's... fan? or? Um, apparently, you can't get it in... Japan. Oh, well, you could probably only get a... Uh, Japanese language version or something like that. It's probably know. better. Uh... Jason, what car are you picking? Uh, well, I'm picking the standard deluxe, I think. But actually, I don't know Lovely. what the other ones are. I might. I might... Well, well, I've changed my mind now. Ah! Oh! Alright, I'll go for one of them. Deluxe, so it is. 
I was just hoping for a bit uh, of advice. I have no all. idea. Without seeing them, I have no idea. I don't recognise half the names. I knew what Deluxo was. What did you Ooh, choose? Oh, it's night time. Oh, Deluxo. Right time. Oh, did you? This one looked a bit like Tron, so I picked it. Because Tron's known for its DeLoreans. No, but it's got the grid. I'm it's off the grid. Is there Are a these the cars that you can... Again? No? Uh, okay, okay. I thought there was, but no. Where are you guys? Are they? What are these uh, big things? What do you mean? Oh my god! Um, the, 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 the things that are standing up uh, by the sides. Yeah, they kind of look, look like big gold posts. Yeah, they look kind of electrified or something. Like all the things from Tron. Ooh. You know the um the ships. Red yeah. not mark the edge of the grid. I don't know. I'm gonna drive through one and see what happens. Do it. Nothing happened. Score a goal. Goal! <laughs> <laughs> Scored all of the goals. What colour am I, by the way? You're pink. Are you, what, are you, what oh, car are you currently looking at? It back doesn't on? look particularly pink. Well, no, it doesn't look <laughs> particularly pink. Oh, what are you doing? I nearly had him. Oh, I see. It's night time. Uh, what's that oh shit, that's a hole. That's boring stuff. Is some of the map falling away? How? What's your guys' experiences of the Harry Potter um, collective um, phenomena? <laughs> Collective do, 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 do. franchise. <laughs> Harry Potter. Um, I've read the books. What are we talking about? The books or are we talking about the films? Well, everything. That's what I'm getting at. Uh, I quite enjoyed the books. Because I um, feel. I quite the films. But I feel. Yeah, you, I'm slightly Well, why is your opinion on this? Yeah, well, why I ask think... me my opinion and then interrupt me? <laughs> well, you, I mean... you, you pause. You, you wait at least half a second and I thought I'll get For it. For dramatic there. effect, I was waiting for the audience to agree with me. Who do you think? Might be waiting a while, this? but <laughs> <laughs> we haven't got a laughter track or anything. It's fine. Let it go. Oh shit! Get out! Um... Oh, I'm out. No! Oh, damn it! <laughs> yeah. No, I think. What I'm... by me and Sean being idiots? Yeah. <laughs> I think I distracted you with Harry Potter knowledge. I nearly went to a Harry Potter quiz. Oh no! I was going to say I nearly went to. It's tomorrow. Jason, finish the first point tomorrow. before moving on. <laughs> What do you That's think of fun. Harry Potter? <laughs> JC's preempting I think I'm the disappointment yeah. that everybody will have by not attending this Harry Potter quiz. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just pointing out there, I'm sorry I'm not going to be there. I've changed my plans. Um, but anyway, um, yeah, I think I'm just slightly too old for Harry Potter. Not in that I don't think it's good or enjoy it, and I do like it when I see it, but I think I, to get the whole sort of fandom craziness, I think I'm just that like, couple of years too old. When I say a couple, I probably mean like I was eight, ten. really hoping that at the end of all of that, you were just going to go, I've never heard of it. <laughs> <laughs> platform nine and three quarters? What's that about? I mean, <laughs> oh, could just could, platform ten, surely. No. I've ah! the, uh, I've Isn't there a new film coming out? There's always another film coming out. I haven't seen any of the... Ex uh, well, Fantastic be Beasts. I've not seen anything uh. other than the main films. And I've only read sort of one and a half of the books. So... I'm not putting it down by any means. I like what I've seen. It's just, it's that whole, like, it, it, it sort of obviously embedded itself in a lot of people's lives. And yeah. People I know are a little bit younger than me, seem to have like, grown up with it, whereas I was an adult when I really started being big, so it didn't really hit me that way. I feel like Pokemon, yeah, really. I mean, so I, me too. I, didn't really I, get that. I read the books, um, which are varying degrees of good. I watched the first three movies and just gave up because they're all terrible. Um, I've been to Harry Potter World, and the first what? bit is like really great fan service, and the second half is all animatronics and like um, scale models and blueprints and stuff, and that's bloody fascinating. Oh, cool! That's just how yeah, the okay, you yeah. know how parts of the film were made. I went with my mum because you know she wanted to go, and but why not? I don't know your mum. Have I ever met <laughs> your mum? I don't know. Have you? I don't know. I don't Probably think I not. Have. I can't think when I'd have ever met your mum. I mean, there's a lot of jokes there, but I, I can't honestly think of a time I actually... I was wondering whether to leap onto one about your mum, but I thought, no, I'm going to keep it classy for once. I've met Jason's mum. Of course you have. I'm His probably dad on the other I don't know if Sean has, but... Sean's definitely... You've all both... You've definitely well, they both were at been, your wedding. You've both definitely been in the same room as my parents. Yes. I mean... 
John a lot more because I went to school with John and we hung out and stuff. Well, I've been around your house. Well, you've been around your parents' house, so that was a big, big indicator of it. Yeah. I, I must have. I, I must have been in the room of the wedding, of the reception at the wedding. Oh yeah, sorry. I didn't invite you to the wedding. No, 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 no. I, I was with the scum. I, I, no, I've, I didn't invite John either. So it's not like you, you know. I didn't invite anybody. Yeah, yeah, no, that's, yeah you only invited me. Yeah, that's me just to calling both reception. of your friends here scum. Then. Don't, don't worry, Sean. It's not just <laughs> you, the scum. I hate John as well. You're both just worthless. And it not was going a, to my weddings. It was a deliberate choice to only invite a small number of people and keep it cheap. That was the point. <laughs> <laughs> only people. And now you're very involved. glad for that decision. I am. As far as you turned up, Jason, you know, could have kept it cheaper. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, and I'm going to say this, uh, I felt, I'm pretty sure it was you, Sean. You wish you hadn't? No, Sorry. but uh, Sean's always been very good at uh, organising stuff around me. I think he's got a crush on you, really. Um, <laughs> fairly sure it was your plan. But despite not being invited to my wedding, as I left the wedding venue, I was greeted, and it was raining on the day as well. I was greeted. It was by fucking quite a lot pissing of I didn't down. Invite. I was greeted by a mob of my friends what? who weren't invited. Uh, not organised by them. <laughs> With pitchforks saying, pitch "Why the bloody hell did we come to your wedding?" Yes. <laughs> or, yeah, or that was all me, baby. Me, despite the sign saying, "Don't throw confetti." Yep. <laughs> oh no 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 no! Yeah, that I did oh, arrange good. that. Yes, you did. Well, I'm very impressed. You've always been. Uh, this game is like the equivalent of three in a bed, isn't it? It's like, and the little one said, "Roll over." It's like, you know, you push them down. <laughs> it's, it's, you know, it's almost exactly like that, <laughs> except for the bit about the bed and the roll over. Getting to the point the now bed. where I don't want to be the first one in. Oh no 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 no! no. Get in! Get in! Get in! I'm in! I'm in! I'm in! Yeah! <laughs> Jason died instead, <laughs> which was. I thought he was safe. Oh, somebody's on fire. I'm well safe. Oh. Is it you? <laughs> Everyone safe was a big word. I'd say, what? That was safe. Oh, sa yeah, it's good. It's safe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I vaguely re there's barely enough room for one car. John, will you be so kind as to not good. come in this circle? I won't come anywhere. Come anymore. in the oblong. Because <laughs> it's, it's about 1988 or nine, probably. Yeah, safe was like that's well safe. That's wicked. I and remember that. Bad. That was that was outers. That was out of order, man. So outers. What are you tan your feet? Don't. You don't that's a very specific person you're naming there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nobody else is going to. A twelve subscriber. <laughs> Am I in or out? And it wasn't. And he didn't pronounce the T in outers either. It was outers. You're outers. Get it right. Yeah, motherfucker. Oh bollocks. Oh, I didn't win that. Oh, that. <laughs> Jason, this game is boss. <laughs> uh, do you remember when we went uh, on holiday? This, sorry, Bloody I should yeah. clarify. So, actually, I'm just going to say it because it's funnier. Do you remember, John, when me and you went on holiday and we came up with a phrase for an erection? Um, no. <laughs> right, I'll say it again. Which holiday was this? I'll say it again properly. We haven't been on many holidays. When we were at school, a, mo a lot of the school went. Uh, and it was us, and for some reason... Oh, I'm still playing this game, I forgot what it was. Uh, for some reason, during that holiday, several of us boys, who were boys in the chat and stuff, came up with the idea of having a hard-on was to be called Chucking It Rude. <laughs> Do you remember that? And I remember writing that phrase. Um, we wrote the phrase on the beach. Now, I can remember that phrase, but I can never remember it being associated with having a hard on. Oh, that's what I thought it was. What did you think it was? Well, you've come up with your own slang and you couldn't even decide what it meant. <laughs> I'm chucking it rude right now. So, Jason, I think that's just in your mind. <laughs> okay. Oh, thanks, man. I really needed to hear yeah, that. Use it in a sentence. There you go. Now, the only problem with this is, Jason, yes. I've got nobody who I can call to confirm or deny because they're all Dead. basically idiots and I don't talk to them. Um, See, this is the difference between you and me, John. I don't burn bridges. <laughs> Particularly by going online. When was the last time you spoke to somebody from school who wasn't me? I like the way there's actual countdown going on. Um, <laughs> 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 
Did it? Did it? Am I right? Is, is Cameron not a school friend of yours then? No, he's like twenty years younger than us. Cameron's like, yeah. I don't know the ins and outs of he's what, a school 20... in Chingford from the early eighties. How long do you think we were held back? It's the late eighties, actually. <laughs> in the late eighties. Um. No, because we had this discussion. Because uh, he was saying he was a certain. Like, um, oh, I don't know. But he said a year, and then I said twenty years less than that, and it was like, oh shit, that's actually correct. I was only joking. Uh, as something <laughs> they we weren't all anyway. that bad, off colleagues at school. No, they're not. I'm just trying. You, like you are quite right. I'm trying to think of someone else I spoke to from school, um, and there must be someone. Well, I mean, there's people on Facebook, obviously. Who I does that count? Know. No, not really, because I don't actually write to them, um, or comment, or like, or anything. Oh, actually, I, <laughs> I just remembered somebody who I do actually like from school. <laughs> so. Hashtag fucking nerd. Um, there, uh, there must be someone. I'm just trying to think of who oh, it is. Yeah, you, you live in the same town as her. Oh, of course, I saw it Sarah. Today. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I got that before you All did. Alright, so yes, I used to live with her. Yes, <laughs> it's quite right. So, yeah, all right, I didn't burn that bridge. I, I saw her just today. Damn it. And Not that you saw Sarah bit. today, I was just trying to get you out of the circle. Damn it, I saw Sarah. Oh, lovely person. Yeah, no, I think I'm in... I don't think there's many people in my life who I've, like... And I'm not saying you have, either, John. I'm just going with a, a general theme now. <laughs> I don't think I've been particularly pissed off with people in my life or given a, a way out that people wouldn't necessarily be okay with me if I saw them again. That's me sitting on the fence again. That's how I live my life. Yeah, I was just about to say. Take a stand. Shades of grey. Um, Why do you need to take a stand on stuff? Nothing really bothers me about what other people do. It's getting good now, fighters. Except for you, John. You really wind me up. <laughs> well, like, from the point of view... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I've got... I've got no interest in, in seeing people from our old school days. No, me either. Um, they are pretty oh, much well, universally to dead to me. Oh, wow. So, I honestly just don't... I don't care. No? Um, you know, um, if they want to come and see me and say hello, I don't really want to chat to them. Um, so, uh, we're doing a, a signing next week, if you'd like to come along. <laughs> It's for fuck a nerd. Um, 2018. <laughs> oh, I thought you meant your old schoolmates were all doing this. I mean, no. Uh, oh, it's one one. Everyone's on one. It's the battle of the best. That's not a phrase, is it? It is now. Okay, so well, I'm putting it out there. Everyone I was at school with, if you want to say hi. And if you want to like, comment, and subscribe, and visit our Patreon, we'd love that. Also, buy a t shirt. Yeah. <laughs> so close. Let's turn this an owl. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> take us back to the Harry Potter. No, no. Take the hole in the leap table, blindly yeah. into it, Jason. It's the only way. Oh shit! Oh shit! I thought I was just in enough and then it came up with the get to the safe zone. Oh, I'm gonna wait, oh, I don't know how I survived that one. I have learned my lesson for the next. Looks like a big old uh, big thing. It does! That's ridiculous! This one looks bigger. That's what I was thinking. <laughs> maybe, it's just, uh, maybe it's just closer. Uh, there's a. <laughs> oh, I see what it's doing. Jason, are you going around in a circle? When you're spectating, the um, it's fine. the, the countdown comes up on the screen, a little blood red clock. It's a lot more exciting. Yeah, it's not going to move now. You have to force the other guy out of the area. Sudden death. Oh, I'm glad you're excited. Yeah, oh, yeah. it's the end game. We've actually got to push each other. Oh, yeah. we actually got to... Oh, so we just stay here doing nothing. It's not gonna... Like a modern-day Caligula, I watch you fight for oh, my but amusement. Oh, getting smaller now. <laughs> Oh, dance, fuck. monkeys, dance! No! No, 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 no! I applaud. Yes, apparently. 
Fuck all the people. <laughs> well, you that's sound like one the, um... person from school I don't want to see again. I only give that rock solid like. <laughs> oh, Pinky McBee. Pinky McBees. Change your name to Pinky McBees. Or don't, you know, whatever. I quite enjoyed that. But I think yeah. oh, I've had enough. 